When it comes to drinking, there are two things in life that I do not like. The first is beer. The second, wine. And as you may have noticed, I have made a point of avoiding both of those on this channel. Um, unfortunately, I can't avoid them any longer. So I am today going to review a wine. Now again, I have to preface this by saying I hate all wine, so I'm probably not going to enjoy this. But, um, you know, still gotta do it. The other thing is I'm, I'm sure there's gonna be somebody being like, oh, of course you don't like it. You're drinking shitty wine. You gotta drink the $200 bottle. No, I should not have to pay $200 just to enjoy something, okay? So today I have Oak Leaf, um, Cabernet Sauvignon. I don't know. I don't know how to pronounce this shit. Um, it's, a, it's a red wine, but now here's, it says is won 200 plus awards. This wine costs $4.50. I don't know anything, anything in the world that is under $5 that has won any awards. So uh, call me skeptical, but I'm not buying it. Um, anyway, we're going to open this thing up and it does have a cork. Screw here. Get this thing out. Bear with me. I literally had to buy a oh, another fucker. Mmm. I had to buy a corkscrew just for this, and now my freaking fracking corkscrew isn't working. Hold on. Okay, we're back. Got the got the cork out. Um, eh, it smells like wine. It smells like horrible wine. I don't have a cup. That's on me. So, bombs up. <laughs> so. It's very strong in all the things that I don't like. Uh, the mouth feel is gross to me. Um, ugh. It's uh, not super sweet. Um, this stuff is 13% alcohol, so I guess better than some. Um, It just tastes like wine. I don't know. People like wine. I am not those people. I don't like this. I guess it's not the worst thing in the world, but it's not good. It just like, it tastes so, I don't know, bitter and horrible. And I don't, I don't like, so, sorry, didn't mean to show off my nipple there. Um, maybe as a wine person, somebody would give this like a four or five out of 10. I'm not a wine person, so I'm just being true to myself. I'm giving this a uh, 2 out of 10.